Well, this is The Buzz UG and uh, my name is Melad Milo aka Fula. I'm back to keep you posted on the stories making headlines in the country. I hope you are doing very good. I hope the day is moving on very well. Now, the latest news I have on the Buzz UG indicates that uh, one of President Museveni's speeding cars that make up his convoy has knocked civilians at the Northern Bypass. It's reported that President Museveni's mobile toilet is one of the vehicles involved in this tragic accident. However, we haven't confirmed how many people have been injured or even dead, but according to what is making rounds on social media, this accident was caused by a border border rider. It should be remembered that this is not the first time one of President Museveni's cars knocking people. In 2020, that lady right there, Juliet Nali, came out in the media with her amputated arm seeking to be compensated after knocked by President Museveni's cars in Buikwe district. However, we don't know if she was compensated. Uh, still in 2020, President Museveni's car knocked and injured that got right there in areas of Boyo Gerere on his way from Jinja and the owner was compensated with 800,000 Uganda shillings. So, a section of the public is calling upon President Museveni's drivers sometimes to be careful, otherwise their speed is too much. Well, quick recovery to the people who have been injured in this accident that just happened at Northern Bypass. Well, in other news, I want to say congratulations to Ann Tyler, the lady who has been doing Akaisanyo on Bukede TV. Uh, you know, she has also joined Next Media Services. Ann Tyler joins Precious Remy from Spark TV and Suna Ben from Bukede TV. Actually, I was on social media and uh, someone jokingly put up a statement that one of these days, King Carissa will forget and poach himself. <laughs> Anyway, congratulations to them. We wish them all the best. And uh, of course, we wait to see what they will be doing right there at Next Media. Well, in other news, inciting violence case against Honorable Muhammad Segrinya has been dismissed by Buganda Road Chief Magistrate Scott. The magistrate ruled that there was no evidence produced to prove that Honorable Segrinya committed the offence charged. Let's hope that even the remaining charges of murder will be dismissed in the nearby future. Well, in other news, now recently Martha Kay bought a Range Rover and uh, it was all over social media. She was so happy and of course it was very understandable. But guess what? The sad news coming in from her camp indicates that this very new car was stolen a night ago. She actually revealed through her social media platforms. However, we haven't confirmed if it's true the car was stolen or she's just playing with Ugandans on social media. Maybe she's just pranking Ugandans. Anyway, that's the bad news right there coming in from Martha Kay's camp. And of course, I'll be keeping you posted on this story in case I get more details about this story. I'll definitely keep you posted what you have to do. Subscribe to the Buzz UG in case you haven't and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. Hash grid, big upon yourself. The likes of Judith Kugonza, big upon yourself. Shakira Mutesi, as usual, big upon yourself. Adonga Stella, big upon yourself. Wanyenza Evelyn, big upon yourself. Bale Soft, big upon yourself. And very many other guys on the Buzz UG. Thank you so much for keeping it right here. You can as well invite other friends to come and be part of us right here on the Buzz UG. Well, my name is Melad Zmilo, a.k.a. Fuller, and it's a bye for now. Thank you. Audio Jungle.